Just after 6 o'clock tonight, Lexis Sad was released from jail after posting bond, and she ran away from our cameras. Watch this surveillance video. Prosecutors say mom Lexis Stagg is behind the wheel, driving the car in reverse. Her three children runs toward the car. She then puts the car in drive and goes forward. Little Lord Renfro could not get out of the way in time. That's not a way to play with children. Neighbor Walter Tershuis remembers that day and how Stagg told police she accidentally backed over her son. The crazy thing to me was that 15, maybe 10, 15 minutes before that happened, he was right inside this patio. But Harris County Prosecutor Sean Tier says the video speaks for itself. Stagg clearly drove forward, he says, and is now charged with criminal negligent homicide. Criminally negligent homicide means that you are acting with gross negligence. You are acting in such a negligent manner that it rises to the level of criminality. On Facebook, Stagg posted pictures of her son and asked how she's supposed to tell her five-year-old daughter about this accident. But Child Protective Services says the mother already has had two older kids removed from her in 2013. After the death of three-year-old Redfro on June 11th, her two remaining kids were also taken away. And now she could face serious jail time. She is facing a minimum of two years in prison, a maximum of 10. Um, and she's charged with that for killing her own three-year-old child. What's up, YouTube? This is James coming back at you with another informative video. I hope everybody's doing well out there. It's, what, Monday morning now? Hope everybody's had a good weekend. I'm doing well myself, and I had a very nice weekend, you know? Very relaxing. <clears throat> Until I came across this story. This is a very, very, very disturbing, just crazy story. And as y'all can see, well, Alexis Staggs right here. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what kind of parenting did, did she think that was, you know, and um, playing chicken, you know, with your, with your children. Um, all I can say to this is, you know, everybody's just not meant to be parents and mental illness. You understand? Something wrong with this. You can look at this woman and see if something ain't right with her. And after what she just did, that proves it, you know. Um, as we've seen in the video, you know, just to recap a little bit. A 26-year-old Houston woman who was driving an SUV toward her children in an apparent game of chicken struck and killed her three-year-old son, authorities say. Harris County prosecutors say it Friday that Lexus Stagg is charged with criminally negligent homicide in the June 11 death of her son. I just don't understand this at all. These people are doing some very, very crazy things, you know? That was just... <laughs> It's bizarre. I mean, what's going on? It, you know, either uh, MK Ultra or Demon Possession, you know, comes to mind with a situation like this. Or straight mental illness. One of the two. I mean, this just is, this is not right. They say surveillance video from an apartment complex shows Stag getting into a Lincoln Navigator, then backing up. As her three young children began running, after her, she drove the SUV forward. Two children moved out of the way, but the third, well, the three-year-old, was caught under a tire. Whew. District Attorney Kim Ogg said, Cars aren't toys, and playing chicken with your children isn't a game. Stag, who, uh, well, Stag was booked into the Harris County Jail, but was no longer being held Saturday. Why would you even give a person like this bond? You know? Child Protective Services told Houston Station KTRK that two of Stagg's older children were removed from her in 2013. According to KTRK, Stagg then had three more children. The other two children involved in the June 11 accident or incident are with relatives. It's not clear whether she has an attorney to speak on her behalf. If I was a, a lawyer, I, I, she couldn't hire me. I don't care how much money she had. I mean, number one, you don't play games like that with your children. And I'm going to tell you this. Those, uh, the older children, <laughs> they was blessed that they were taken from her. You know? And the other ones are blessed to be, you know, in the custody of uh, some, you know, relatives. 
it's just uh, it's ridiculous. It's crazy. You know, when I see a lot of the stories of what a, uh, a lot of these young people, you know, are doing with their children, it just it behooves me to understand why the hell are they doing these things? Something's wrong. But y'all tell me what y'all think about this situation. Um, I'm interested in hearing y'all comments, well, ideas and what have you. Uh, like, comment, share, and subscribe. And this is James, and I'm out. Peace.